Hello, everybody, and welcome to this edition of Politics NY, Know Your Candidates in 2022. I'm Jane Hansen, and I asked three questions in three minutes. And today we're talking with Kelly Leeson, who is running for the Assembly District 73, a seat being vacated by Dan Court, who'd been there for a while. Um, and it goes from 32nd Street to 94th Street on the east side of Manhattan. Kelly, welcome. Um, I know that Thank you've you. um, spent a lot of time in Africa working with refugees in Kenya in particular, um, a New Yorker, certainly by birth. Uh, tell us mm -hmm. why is it you've decided to get into politics and run for office? Thank you so much, Jane. Um, so yes, part of the reason why I'm running for office is that we are in a really critical moment right now here in our city and in our state after two really tumultuous years. And so what do we need right now? We need competent, innovative leadership. And that's really what I bring to the seat, um, given all of my experience that you, um, that you noted. Um, I worked for many years overseas working with organizations like the International Rescue Committee. Um, in that work, I oversaw a team of 400 staff members, um, oversaw two hospitals, you know, always delivering really quality services in resource poor locations, but at the same time, always looking at the big picture. What was the policy that we needed to change to help to make people's lives better? And it was with that that I, you know, started a global initiative to help refugees to rebuild their lives. Um, and this is a, you know, a humanitarian uh, innovation that is changing the sector. And then in my spare time, I have been leading the Empire State Indivisible, part of uh, Invest in Our New York building relationships in Albany to also make sure our state governing government is delivering for regular New Yorkers. It's well, those relationships and those expertise that I bring to this. Well, if you've been um, in Albany a lot, then I'm sure you're prepared to answer this question, which is what's the first thing you're going to do if you're elected? Yes. So, I mean, there's so many issues that people bring up to me, um, you know, about affordable housing, child care. I'm going to jump into those issues. But what I'm really going to tackle, um, Jane, is climate action. In 2019, New York passed the Climate Leadership and Community Protection Act. And that is nation leading legislation, but at the same time, we're not funding it properly. In this last year's budget, uh, advocates were asking for $15 billion to kickstart um, our climate action and the Climate Leadership and Community Protection Act. And that did not get put into the budget. Wow. And so we need in this on this island, resilient city um, to really reduce our climate, our carbon emissions. And so that's what I'm gonna be tackling to make sure we put resources behind this. All right, last question quickly. What's something about you that we don't know and you wanna tell us? Quickly, one <laughs> last question. What should we know about you that we don't? Yes. So I've lived uh, half of my adult life overseas. Um, so I, and in my work, I've seen what it looks like when the, um, systems really fail. And I really understand the fragility of our democracy here. So that's why I'm so excited to jump in and contribute to this vibrant democracy of ours. Um, and I also, you know, people that talk to me about, you know, big bad Albany. Well, you know, I worked in South Sudan during a civil war. I was questioned by the FSB um, working with Chechen refugees in uh in russia so i think i can handle albany and i'm ready to deliver for assembly district 73 <laughs> all right thank you so much kelly best of luck to you on the campaign thank trail you. and as usual thanks to all of you for watching